the National Women's Soccer League and WSL postponed all of its upcoming weekend matches, officials said Friday, following allegations of sexual misconduct against a former coach. North Carolina Courage coach Paul Riley was fired on Thursday after a report in The Athletic detailed allegations made by players on teams that Riley has coached since 2010. The news also comes after the Players Union on Thursday called for an end to systemic abuse plaguing the NWSL. And WSL Commissioner Lisa Baird on Friday apologized to players and staff. This week, and much of this season, has been incredibly traumatic for our players and staff, and I take full responsibility for the role I have played. I am so sorry for the pain so many are feeling, and WSL Commissioner Lisa Baird said in a statement. Recognizing the trauma, we have decided not to take the field this weekend to give everyone some space to reflect. Business as usual isn't our concern right now. Two matches had been scheduled for Friday and three more on Saturday. The Washington Spirit were set to play at North Carolina on Friday, along with NJ, NY Gotham at Racing Louisville FC. Also postponed from Saturday's card, were Orlando Pride at Chicago Red Stars, Houston Dash at Kansas City, and OL Reign at Portland Thorns FC. Baird said the pause will serve as a first step in transforming the league's culture. Our entire league has a great deal of healing to do, and our players deserve so much better, Baird added. We have made this decision in collaboration with our Players Association and this pause will be the first step as we collectively work to transform the culture of this league, something that is long. In the athletic report veteran midfielder Sinead Farrelly said she had been coerced into having sex with her coach, Riley, on multiple occasions. Fairly and midfielder Monashim both told the online sports publication that after a night of drinking in 2015, Riley brought them back to his apartment and pressured them to kiss each other as he watched. Riley responded in writing to The Athletic and denied having sexual relations with players. I have never had sex with or made sexual advances towards these players, he wrote. Some of the game's most iconic players, such as U.S. stars Alex Morgan and Megan Rapino, lashed out at league leadership for not doing more to prevent the alleged abuse. The league was informed of these allegations multiple times and refused multiple times to investigate the allegations, Morgan said in a statement on Thursday, the league must accept responsibility for a process that failed to protect its own players from this abuse. Rapino accused the club on Thursday of obscuring what might have been a darker reason for his release, men protecting men who are abusing women. Breaking news emails. Be the first to know about breaking news and other NBC News reports. Sign up. This site is protected by RECAPTCHA privacy policy terms of service.